Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Alan, and today we're going to be talking about plotting with ChatGPT. Um, what is a plot? Why you need a plot? And um, frameworks and prompts for plotting and turning your idea into a fleshed out plot. So let's uh, first, let's get a story idea. And if you haven't already, you can get this template in the description below. It's free. Or you can grab the chat GPT writing mastery guide um, and then follow along. So I'm going to go to my ideas and I'm going to just plug in a few ideas. Okay. Let's see. Let's say So let's say a crime thriller novel idea. And then you can go to Amazon and grab different genres to combine to create a totally unique genre. Go to crime fiction. You got murder, kidnapping, thrillers. Suspense. Let's do a psychological. And then let's also combine it with something else. You can even combine it with science fiction. Let's say dystopian science fiction. And then plugging in these details are optional. It just gives your uh, story idea. It makes the story idea much more unique. Um, let's say time traveler. Who is... Wanted time traveler. Serial killer. All right, so write a crime thriller novel idea in the psychological genre, in dystopian science fiction genre, about a wanted time traveler serial killer.
All right, so this is what I got. Um, I'm not going to read it all here, but if you want to read it, I will copy and paste it inside um, the description. And I will also leave it inside the email if you are part of uh, the email list. So what we're going to do is we're going to use a prompt to turn this story idea into uh, a three-act structure. My favorite is the Dan Harmon story structure, but to keep it simple, we'll use the three-act structure. Again, you can get this in the link below, either in the Writing Mastery Guide uh, with ChatGPT, or you can get it in the free template in the description. So yeah, three-act structure has the setup, the confrontation, and the resolution. This is to, just to keep the story um, flowing and make sure the reader is engaged. So the prompt I'm going to use is plot a three-act plotting structure using the following idea, and I'll plug the idea into this brackets. You can also use plot four different stories using the three act structure based on the following idea. Uh, you can say plot two stories using the three act structure, using the following story idea. And you can add additional ideas if you thought the idea that chat GPT produced wasn't everything that you wanted. So you can just add that additional, that additional information right there. So example, Plot four different stories based on the hero's journey and the following story idea. So I'm going to go with this first one. And since it just produced the idea, I don't actually have to plug the idea into the brackets. I can just say plot a three act. Plotting structure using that idea. And then it'll start to break it down in each act. So again, if you haven't already, uh, grab the template in the description and you'll get all these uh, prompts and uh, frameworks to help you plot with ChatGPT. And right now I'm using ChatGPT4, which is supposed to be more creative, but you'll still get uh, quality outputs with ChatGPT3. If you're using the free version of ChatGPT, Chat I would uh, suggest upgrading. It's only $20 a month. All right, so we broke it down into three acts. I'm just going to read over it real quick to make sure it's concise and makes sense. All right, so that is pretty good. I just read it. Um, it does follow the story idea. Again, I'm going to leave the story idea inside the comments of the video, but I'm also going to put the story idea along with the story idea along with the three acts it produced inside the free template you can get in the description below. If you already have the template, you'll be able to see it. Um, once you see this video but so yeah that's plotting with chat gpt and the reason you want to do this before you move on to actually having chat gpt write a story is because it needs a framework and something to follow if you're going to uh, write first you need a plot and then you need an outline 
and then you can have it right from the outline. So ChatGPT needs to follow these steps if you want to have a concise and well-written story um, that you can publish. So there are also other ways you can produce plots that are more refined and um, structured the way you write. And you do that by creating frameworks and models, which you can find in the ChatGPT mastery it's not the uh, free template but if you get that mastery writing guide you'll find frameworks and models in there that you can use to create your own models for chat gpt to plot the way you write all right so um i hope that helps with plotting with chat gpt um it's really not that difficult if you can get chat gpt to think the way you think and to understand plots, you can train it to plot. Then you'll have um, an outline that then you'll be able to produce an outline from this plot and then have ChatGBT write your full book for you. Of course, you'll have to pay attention to continuity and make sure it's consistent. But this is one of the fastest ways to produce novels. Um, probably for the next the next decade. If you're a writer, I would highly suggest taking advantage of this tool. Again, it's like, it's not gonna replace writers, but um, a lot of writers might fall behind if they don't take advantage of using ChatGPT or any other AI technology like Jasper. Um, I know produces novels as well so yeah take advantage again the link is in the description for the free template as well as the chat gpt writing mastery guide that you can get it'll teach you how to build frameworks and models to write the way you want it to write and think the way you want it to think